Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. Philadelphia City Council passed a bill this afternoon cracking down on curfews in the city. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Roberts spoke with the councilwoman behind the effort as critics argue it's putting police in a difficult spot. The councilwoman who created this bill is a mother herself. She tells me her goal is to help protect young people who all too often fall victim to our city's violence. There are too many young people who have been involved in crime or criminal incidents simply because they have been out late at night. On Thursday, Philadelphia City Council passed a bill requiring anyone 17 years old and younger to be home by 10 p.m. There are a few exceptions, including if the teen is with a parent or going to and from work. Councilwoman Catherine Gilmore Richardson created the legislation and says its aim is preventative versus punitive. When a kid gets picked up for violating curfew, the first step is to try to reunite. Unify them with their family. If that's unable to happen, then we'll take them to a community evening resource center if they're close. If not, they go to the police district. The bill includes expanded curfew hours, which will stay open through 2 a.m., and reporting from Philadelphia police on its enforcement. A young person could show their ID. Not many young people have an ID card, so maybe they have a school ID card. We can't just stop anybody for any reason anymore. How are we going to determine a 15 year old from a 20 year old or a 20 year old that looks 15? But retired Philadelphia Warrant Unit Sergeant Mark Fusetti argues given police staffing issues and added security in recent years, officers worry this measure puts even more risk on their shoulders. Well, officers are going to be are going to hesitate because this is another chance for them to get in trouble. The bill still needs to be approved by Mayor Jim Kenney. His office tells me they are currently reviewing it. In Spring Garden, Alicia Roberts, CBS3 Eyewitness News.